M&A. OK, coming thick and fast in the US at the moment. And uh, once again, we're in the telecoms and media sector. T-Mobile, uh, which viewers might recall was the uh, that was the, the mobile phone arm of Deutsche Bank, uh, Deutsche Bank, sorry, Deutsche Telekom spun off in the US as an independent business now. Um, it's said to be in talks with Dish Networks and the tickers here are TM for uh, T-Mobile US and Dish, very simply D-I-S-H US. Uh, so we're talking here about the possibility of mobile phones and satellite TV conversion. Um, in terms of how the deal might look, uh, the CEO of Dish is apparently going to be the chairman of the merged group. The, the uh, boss of uh, T-Mobile US will become the CEO of the merge group. Interestingly, uh, they've, they've agreed the sort of titular structure. They don't seem to have agreed the terms and structure of a deal. It's well, terms. as long as the management are right, I think that's the main thing, isn't <laughs> well, it? Well, it's interesting that they should, they should start at the top and work down. Most um, important things come first. Yes, so we need to find a bit more about what price and terms would be involved. Um, what's interesting here is this is the second deal or potential deal in, in the space. AT&T are just about to complete uh, their purchase of DirecTV. AT&T obviously a direct rival of T-Mobile and DirecTV, uh, as, as you may or may not be aware, are a competitor to Dish Networks. The AT&T uh, DirecTV deal was worth around $49 billion. Um, obviously not sure of the value of the, of the of the new deal that's on the table but if the, we just look at the combined market cap of T-Mobile and Dish uh, then we'd be talking about uh, a company with a combined market cap of around 65 billion dollars. Why is all this happening? Well we've touched on this before but basically media and telecoms groups are trying to get the correct mix uh, of, of, and I say correct they're inverted commas because no one's quite sure what that is of connectivity uh, how he links to yeah, it's a bit of a sort content. of multi-channel buzzword type of thing. That, yeah. you know, they've got all the telephones, the viewing, everything in one internet, everything in one yeah. bundle. I mean, whether whether people really want that, uh, the well, customer, nobody knows. No, they don't. I, for, for my mind, I don't think it. it you know, one or two pence worth. Whether I wouldn't be overpaying for uh, for connectivity. I think uh, content is where the value will be will be found. Interestingly enough, that the content might be the the next area uh, for consolidation, um, and that could that consolidation could well be driven by John Malone, who is one of the main players in this this whole U.S. telecoms and media area. He's speculated that uh, that that's the next phase, and in fact, he could possibly be the driving force behind it. So we'll we'll be returning to this, I think, uh, okay. fairly regularly over the next uh, three to six months.